today to the small home group and new believers to show the second movie. Yeah, it was about reconciliation with people, about forgiveness and about um, asking for forgiveness and giving back what you took from people by force when you hurt them to restore this relationship. It was very good. People were like listening like you will not believe how they were like, they were so quiet. Even children were like into it, like all ears. They were so, so, so learning from it. There were other parts too that they got it, but this one, after the movie, Kafians, the girl who is leading it, the one who got saved in the prison, she gave her testimony and I was blown away. I didn't know this testimony. I didn't hear from her. Because she's quiet. She doesn't tell me the good things. Uh, she said, when she first saw this movie, and I remembered, I just told this enable the story yesterday, that uh, she was the only one, after the second movie she watched, who raised the question, like, what should I do? So she started like this. When I watched this movie, and I'm in prison, and I heard many people, and I took so many, I had deaths, deaths, deaths from different people, and I didn't know what to do, so the movie taught me to get straight with people and ask for forgiveness and bring back what I took from them, but I, I, I couldn't. So I asked the question, what should I do? And Mama told me, uh, at least ask for forgiveness and try to reconcile without paying back. Like, when you can, ask for forgiveness. So she was kind of stressed about it because she has so many bad stories to tell and so many people heard she was leading here she is leading the church there in prison and there is a girl inside who is a believer now because of the church and the prison she got saved in the prison some member of her family comes and tells her ah what are you doing you are listening to kofians this girl is a rebel she's a bandit she heard so many people she heard our family never go back again don't listen to her she's a pro she will not teach you right she doesn't know the bible blah, blah, blah. so they were so angry they forbid this girl to come into the meetings kafians was very sad she cried and cried and asked god what to do so she found somebody who knew somebody who knew these family members and sent them through the prison she sent a message through somebody to the boy who could go to this family and ask them to come and visit her in prison, the ones she heard. And the story behind it, she got into fight with some young boy and broke his arm. And the father of this boy was so angry because she's poor, like poor than poor. She has no parents to pay for this, uh, for the hospital bill, nothing. She can't pay them back anything. So the father tells Kafians, I don't want to see you again ever ever in my life. I will not see you again. So this is the people she called to come to prison. And miraculously they come. They paid for their transport, they came to the prison to see her. She is there trembling, she doesn't know what to say. This boy with the broken arm is there in prison with her. And she tells them, I got saved and Jesus told me reconcile with people I heard so I can't pay you back the money that you paid for the hospital or anything that the problem I brought but I'm asking you for forgiveness so everybody cried they cried they, they reconciled they really believed her they said okay you don't owe us anything and they even gave her money wow some money to be there like you know, to buy some little things because in prison they don't feed people and it's very poor so um now it's not the end of the story now she came out of the prison like a year later she told this guy the father of the boy when i come out uh, i want to see you and he's like great we can go to church together we can pray together she came out of prison she found him uh she said i gave her a phone yeah i helped her with the phone and she texted him like now i'm out of the prison i'm a firm believer and i want to have relationship with you like proper they began to encourage each other she's praying for him he's praying for her she sends him bible verse, verses every day they became such friends 
and this is the like the most beautiful thing that could come out of this simple movie about reconciliation with the people you heard.